Well, as the sun sets on my last night at Byron, having a coldie, I've had a great time. It's been awesome. Well, that was Byron Bay, we're on the road to Crescent Head. I've got a full tank of fuel and 35 bucks. Let's see if we can make it. Payday's tomorrow, so I'm sweating on that. I found a caravan park there, or a camping park. It's about 10 bucks a night, so I should be set. Um, and it's about 450k, so I think we'll make it. Fuel. My fuel gauge works backwards by the way, for some weird reason. Um, so we've made it away from Byron to Kempsey. So Kempsey's just over there and there's a service centre about 5 k's from here. Fingers crossed we'll make it to the service centre. I'll stick 20 bucks in it, that'll get me to Crescent Head. I'll have $15 to pay for my campsite and I've got some food in the boot so we're winning. So hopefully the plan comes together, let's see how we go. Bam, bam. Swell is massive and as far as bushwhackers go like myself, I ain't getting in that. That's too dangerous for me at my level. Um, I'm going to go and find this campsite and uh, get set up and then we'll find somewhere a little bit more uh, user friendly to surf. We'll see how we go. I'll ask around.
campsite and we'll set up and um, it's a cool little place it's about I don't know 10 minute drive south of Crescent Head town it's still part of Crescent Head but it's called Waves Campground and um, it's unreal it's just an awesome bush setting um, a short walk to the beach I don't know if you can hear it on the here but waves are crashing um, no one on the beach is like just the local people here that are staying here on the beach it's awesome but saying that the swell is ridiculous the locals are saying that it's the biggest they've seen in a long time and it's way too dangerous especially for my nine footer um, the guy that runs this joint said there's a little place about another probably I don't know 10 minute drive south from here again on the dirt road where it's supposed to be a really good sheltered um, spot for longboarding so and he also said that the swell should calm down overnight so we'll see how we go if it's not calming down i'm not staying because i'm here to surf um, camping's all well and good but i'll get bored really quickly so i've got my minestrone soup on the stove warming up my warm beers are cold and i'm chilled this is good so unless anything unbelievable happens tonight I will see you tomorrow. See ya.